Punji or Punjo? Ceres gets mulliganed. We actually mulliganed in the last game for Kusiro. We still had that like super gold heavy hand. Cultist probably just goes anyway. Maybe Sick Drifter goes. We could have bricked this uh get away with it. So no Melusine this time. Up against overwhelming hunger. Kind of like the idea of just opening up Harold because of things like Manticore and such. Uh, we lost most of our games, but yeah, I think it's good. We just need to work out how to build it still. Yeah, if you've got um, scale, if you've got Amazon Prime, you can link your Twitch account to your Amazon account. And then once you do that, you get whenever you like press the when you go to subscribe to someone on their channel, it'll tell you that you can use your free Twitch Prime sub to do it before you like confirm your payment details or anything like that. It'll go use free Twitch Prime sub. Emo? Oh god, what am I doing? They're all so different. Nice. Maddock. Bruh. Nice. So in case you guys weren't aware, what they're going to be trying to do is... Um, Eat the Maddock with Arrakis Queen. Okay, I also need to... Uh... So now they can play Maddox. It's a pretty, pretty cool idea. I don't have any more damage, unfortunately, available. No point trying to kill this. Look at the self wound from Harold, though. It would be, wouldn't it, Bane? I'm new to this, all right. Oh yeah, what, what was I thinking they can eat this already? Not true, but I mean, look, this this card, instant impact. I honestly wouldn't be surprised if we end up playing two of these. Yeah, no Melusine is definitely is worse, but I don't think it's worth putting like Roll the Cream when we're already thinning Ceres. Artist thins. We have discard package. A superb specimen, truly. Is there a reason my, uh, your, yeah? Because it will say Twitch use Twitch Prime sub, basically. Okay, they only got one extra medic. So um, if it's not if it's saying pay, it means you've not linked it probably, mate. Would be my guess. So I only have one healing card in hand. This is a pretty big commitment, I think. This deck feels really nice, actually. Like, look at the synergy, mate. The Harold's just popping off. I'm really loving this deck, mate. This is my favorite deck I've played so far. Look at the flamenca. <laughs> Guys, look at that. That is just so good. Pass? Um. I mean, I guess their bomb is going to be... 
I guess it could be a pass. Flamenca. Am I saying it right now? No? Flam. Menka. Cool. Cheers. My hands just too good in it. I did mulligan golds as well. I mulligan Sig Driffer. Oh, hello, lovely. Hello, darling. So is that creepy? If they push, we just slam jump the artists. Obviously, the worry is that you know I've not enabled my Sig Driffer. Like, even, mate, Sig Jeffrey on this is no joke, right? Like, it's not that bad. Hey, sword. Wear premium. I can uh, probably open some cakes to get a premium. I mean, we could have bricked the Ceres there, actually, thinking about it. That would have been a bit of a sticky situation. I asked, should I buy the classic combo pack or just craft new cards? What is the classic combo pack, Sword, please? And I can I can let you know. Nice to see you, Sword. Hope you are. Hey, out of Vandalo. Unless you were speaking to Ceres. <laughs> yeah, that's true. I might just need a refresh of the stream. I'm not called. Who are you calling Specky, by the way? You're not talking to me, right? <laughs> you're not. You're not calling me Specky, are you? So we could play Artist again off Sig Driffer. It's probably worth it. Right? Need a specky emote? True. Not false. We need our, our Ceres, man. Oh my. What? What? They had red haze the whole time. Brilliant. You hate Twitch? Me too, brother. No, I don't really hate Twitch. <laughs> Thanks, Shady. We needed that win, mate. It'd been too long for the Blues. Okay. Combo Wombo. I don't like my pass in round one, basically, on reflection. Should have just kept playing some cards. I appreciate the skill, mate. Thanks for support, man. Ceres is a bit of a stinky situation. But I can heal this, right? Damage something else. Almost tempted to go for the Ceres now. Mm, a superb specimen. Love my analysis on Gwent Masters, Specy. Thank you, Vegas. Hey, Mr. Paul, what's up, man? How was your stream, mate? Mm, a superb specimen. How did you How did you enjoy day one? Yo, August. Thank you so much for the follow. A lone fan phantasm. Sultan, PUBG. Cheers, mate. Mate, this flamenco is so good in this deck, man. 
Please don't kill her. Please don't high roll. Oh my god, I thought they high rolled. Holy moly. So I'm pretty sure Ceres won't work if I thin on armor. So we've learned a lesson here. I actually am maybe a little bit short on self damage in case I miss Melusine, right? Which is why like another one of these could be an idea too. Maybe the maybe it's just one armor Drakkar and, and double cultists, like for example. Right? So I need to self thin now, basically self damage now. <laughs> Guys, did you see that? Did you see that chat? Healed by three. Yes. Healed by three. Damage three. Oh my god. Oof. That was not bad. Why didn't heal Flaminka? Because I was going to kill this, right? Maybe I wasn't. Maybe it was just bad. <gasps> it's kind of bad at this moment in time, right? No, I can just that. Oh, mate. Ceres is going to help me set this. Oh, my God. So, if we say Ceres is safe... Do I want to leave this? Because it's damage. This is going to be. I think I want to leave it, right? Please don't kill her. Oh! She's dead, isn't it? Wait, I can put it in the Maddox stuff. It's fine. She's not healing herself, by the way. I thought she did. That's just me being dumb. Maybe I should have waited because it's now dying to a bomb when it wasn't before, right? <laughs> oh, no. Come on, the Vild, Carl. Tank. Be a tank. Be a legend. Come on. Oh. Nope. Yeah. We're one damage off though, right? Click it. We win still, despite like the misplays. Let's go. Let's go. Let's go. Oh, undefeated. This is just so good, mate. This is great, mate. This is the best patch ever. Vengeance, huh? Not 
Hey Sven, what's up man? Thank you so much for the nine month sub, my friend. Good day. Yo, Wagwan, brother. So obviously they if they get the crew pocket on vengeance, my is just gonna uh say no. Okay. Siege. Is this a henselt deck, guys? Sounds like it might be. Looks like it might be rather. I wonder if bleeding counts for Sarah, so we can find out, right? She's counting nine as it stands. You beg for death. She doesn't. It doesn't count. Which is good, it shouldn't, right? I thought it might. It shouldn't, I'm not damaging it. It's not when my stuff gets damaged. It's when you deal damage. So this is correct. This is like the intended interaction, right? If you were to self-bleed, maybe, yeah. Uh, I don't know exactly how you self-bleed though, honestly. Sorry, Paul, I didn't even catch you earlier. Like, what, what have you been playing, mate? Sven, patch day is popping off. It's my favorite patch ever. Maybe not ever, I don't know, it's too early to say, but it's my favourite, it's the most fun I've had playing Gwen in a flipping long time. Villager? Yeah. Hey, Blaze. What do you want? So I'm thinking Singer on the Butcher? Butcher? A wee sacrifice. Weaver's kind of busted. Yeah, I need to play her. Thanks, boys. I haven't played AQ at all yet with Weaver's or anything. Winch is broken, mate. You guys remember when I was playing the uh, the Vengeance version of Radovid and then I started playing Flippin'? No... Vengeance and how bad the deck felt. I remember. Vengeance just needs a nerf. A big enough. God, it's broken, mate. Where's the healing at, man? <gasps> Wait, I actually have a healing card, right? That's actually so good. Holy shit. Oh, what am I doing? This positioning, man. This positioning, mate. Wow. Wow, we. So bad. I just slam jammed an artist into a pass, mate. Very, very, very good stuff. This card is so busted, man. Holy shit. It's so broken, mate. It's just way too many points, man. I'm going to get clowned on by Siege if I pass. So honestly, I don't think I'm allowed to pass. I have not tried Syndicate. I will be trying Syndicate though. For sure. We probably go Syndicate after this deck. Play a few more with this. I also do want to try AQ stuff though. Ah, uh, I couldn't play around that guys. There was no other line.
Doing stock. I have not played stockpile yet, so I've not done Henselt. I did a vote for Henselt. Okay, let's take it this way. Let's go. Ceres is at four. Oh! Guys, if you heard a voice crack, it was just a problem with the Twitch uh, stuff. Yeah, it was not me. This card's poopy, 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 poopy. Oh, yeah, yeah, mate. This card's not even that bad, right? It's a bit of shit, but... Onslaught is giving out armor like it's Christmas. Actually, yeah, I know. I heard it's bu uh, bugged with Mort Fog, unfortunately. That's a bit sad. I definitely want to... Man, there's so much to do, man. How does the thing work where we can look in the deck? Mega cool feature. Yeah, mate. It's a banger feature in it. It's um linked to basically to my GOG account. So like my Gwent account is like linked uh, with a Twitch extension. So we get the siege. Job done. Job done, guys. No worries. We could have played Melusine. Melusine's still just good in round three with the stick. And then for Siggy, we have Olaf. And ideally, you want to Fakusia the Vild Carl, right? Because it's seven provisions on the champion. So you get the Fakusia onto Vild Carl, which is 16. And then you get three turns of range, so it's 22. Three Scythemen, though. So this goes, and the scalp goes for sure. I forgot I had a brick. Oh. Rippers. I should have just kept the hand, mate. It was actually. I mean, nah. I'm looking for this, man. I reckon we still win. We've already seen both oils. I reckon we still win, guys. I mean, it's true, maybe the discard package is bad, and we just actually don't want to play it. And we want to play the normal Ceres. Like, it's very, very possible, right? It's still an option. We could just ditch discard package and say, actually, the synergy is too bad. But, and in fairness, I think you still play this card in this deck. Maybe, maybe, maybe we actually don't play discard package. But the problem with that logic is, we end up playing, like, Royal Decree. Which you kind of want for a Melusine deck anyway, but just draw the flipping thing anyway, right? Yeah, the bricks will be pretty tremendous. So here they have three, four. Maybe it's going to summon self from uh, from our hand, mate. 
Um, it has taken a big hit, but like actually, what I like about this card is it. I think it's still good, maybe too good, but it actually makes a bunch of sense. Like it actually has a ton of synergy in this deck, right? It's not just like I'm randomly playing it. Like, it actually makes a bunch of sense in this deck because of like the synergy it has with Vild Carl, for example, Melusine. I don't know. It might still be auto include. I still think it's too good. But also it caught basically a big nerf because of Coral getting a provision. So if you res Coral, it's two points less of rain now as well. Right? So there's quite a lot going on there that doesn't initially necessarily meet the eye. Nice one, I'll take care, mate. Thanks for hanging out, my friend. But you can see the Scar Package is just pretty legit in this deck anyway. Right? But yeah, we could play normal Ceres and Shield Maidens, but I don't think it's honestly worth... I think Olaf is my uh, play, right? We might kill this still, to be fair. Think drawing the Ceres costs us right. If I have Fukushima, like I'm just winning. I, think. I could have Sig Drifted the um the Olaf and then Fukushima the Heim, for example. GG, fun game. Didn't quite go all the way in the end. Radovid is a shit ton of points in it. So we would have had a Fukushima more if we drew her, which is like 20 points, right? Would have been pretty damn close. On crate! Blood runs thick. Oh, my posture's so bad, guys. Holy shit. Kind of need to eat some food, man. I haven't eaten anything yet. Honestly, I also kind of want to do this AQ Maddox stuff. Good. 
Um, sorry. So you could also play like Mardromes, right? But... Ardle cheese tactics. What do you mean cheese? Just like Ardle tactics. I haven't actually played against any myself, but we, we did try a little bit. Um... Butcher. We could honestly cut the fanatic too. But I'm also not sure on artist. Jury's very much out. Maybe he's just like a poopy card. Maybe you even try and play discard package and roll the crit and Ceres. Now yeah, you could put it all. But these cards are also good because they're helping us get bloodthirst on the Drakkar. Do we take a leader charge here ever? I don't think so. Look at what you built. Oh, Jesus Christ, mate. You need Jesus, mate. Guys, click on Kate's link and tell me that she does not need Jesus. Wow, they pass, mate. Okay. So this plays as a seven already. And then I've got... Mate, this deck is kind of just really... Oh, I shit myself. This deck is just kind of feeling really good. Honestly, like, cutting the Scar package just lets us play more synergistic bronzes, which is kind of interesting. They're not part of the Price of Power expansion. It's just like a mini release, really. Which there's going to be more stuff like this moving forwards, basically. So I think the Cultist can go... Monka S. Probably should have just kept the hand. So we want to, like, develop engines as soon as possible. So we don't want to open with Ceres. Like, she could be our round three, one of our round three point slam plays. Um, we could start with Drakkar, for example, right? Or maybe, I mean, I want to start with Blue Balls. But what, where are the engines even? Like, I don't even have engines in this hand rope. Why would I start with this? It doesn't really have much synergy. So I guess I'm just slamming points. Like, I could slam Ceres and Vildkarl, right? For example. Yeah, exactly. That's it, right? It does feel like an expansion. And that's it. Like, it feels more like an expansion than a lot of the twelve card, uh, the 24 card drops did. I think. Let's go, man. Let's go, mate! You stand before the Queen of Skellige. Oh, ho, ho, ho! 
get absolutely emoted. You ain't got a chance, son. What are you going to do about that, huh? Oh! The synergy. It's unfortunate. Show me the ice, son. Boy. Show me that ice, boy. It's hard to say. I wouldn't say irrelevant. I wouldn't say. But there's definitely going to be some new uh, hotness. But obviously everyone's playing the new hotness today. But that doesn't mean that all your old decks are suddenly going to be terrible. Like, what they're trying to achieve is make these new decks competitive. While then still having, like, the old decks being good. Irrelevant is definitely a very strong word. Yeah, I don't like the blue balls already. I don't like this card. Bruh. Bruh. That is a problem. Time it. Honestly, might have been the line. Look how many golds are in my deck, man. Like, this is what happens when you kick this card package, mate. Exerius is just a worse burner, right? She played for 8, 12, 16. Eats a leader charge. Yeah, the blue boy was a bad addition. Because uh, every time I heal at the start of a round, it'll get me some points. This is what happens when you don't play the scar package. The deck just end, you just end up missing a shit ton of cards, right? It's not the vibe. Yeah, Lugos was a bad addition. I never liked Lugos anyway. We're already losing, it's fine. I should have should have used it on Tag V. Never mind. I think the 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 list I shared is pretty much fine.